Welcome back. We're giving you a look outside on this beautiful, sunny Thursday morning of the Savannah Riverfront. Prominent members of the Savannah community will be getting up on stage and going for laughs this weekend. And they're doing it to help local students. So this morning we have Clinton Edminster and Shaughnessy Cargyle. They're two of the volunteer comics competing in Saturday's Stand Up For Kids Celebrity Comedy Show. The event's going to be at the American Legion Post 135. And it's going to benefit the Performance Initiatives Youth Programs. Good morning and thanks so much for coming on today. Good morning. Happy this to be here. This is such a great event. Laughs for a good cause. Tell me more. You go first. Local celebrity first. Oh my gosh, me? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Are you going to be one of the celebrity comics? Yes, I am. So, so Shaughnessy and, and I and Grace Sotomayor are all the comics for that night. And I just have to tell this first, is we do not do stand-up comedy. That's not how we get paid in our regular lives. So okay. just, you know, I really want to set not the, the highest bar. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you know? you I mean, you might kill no, it. It's very good. We're going to be very funny. Grace okay. is the funniest. Obviously. By far. Why is then that? it goes Why down. Well, she works with little kids, okay. so she lots of material. That. Kids have jokes. You know, and kids are jokes. You have to be careful what you say around kids, so she's been holding in. She's a repressed <laughs> yeah. comic. She's got a lot of content. Because you can't say, no, actually, that is a dumb question. Please go back to your, you know, playpen area. You have to be like, oh, no, good question, but it's not a good question. It's so Grace has the question. most material, probably. But okay. what, what are the Sorry. details we got to get out? Yeah, Saturday. So tell, me, tell me more about, I mean, you guys said you're the two of the comics. Tell me, how have you prepared for this? You, you kind of told us oh. to keep our expectations in check, but I didn't know how we were have you prepared? To... I mean, you're not no. a professional comic, so how no. have you prepared for this? It's an improv Unprofessionally. show. Is it an improv? <laughs> this is not an improv show. Actually, you're supposed to prepare for it. I didn't get that memo. <laughs> I didn't get that. So what have you done? You just are coming on and giving you know, it a whirl? I've or? got a small list. I've got an index card, and I'm going to have, you know, I'll probably have like a margarita before, and I'm just going to wing it. And you okay. know what? But people better give money because those kids need it. All right. So how can the community get involved in this? How can they contribute to this wonderful well, I would go. I would go. It should go be actually yeah. an absolute gas. So the event is at 6 p.m. on Saturday at the American Legion, right below Forsyth Park. Um, you can get tickets online. Just look up Stand Up For Kids. Probably okay. Google that. Um, and what else? And you can get tickets at the door. Tickets at the door. Or if you can't make the show, you could just donate. Okay. Because Performance Initiative does a great job of getting kids from wherever they are in life now to better grades, to being mentored, and to learning learn weightlifting skills. Yeah. yeah, they do like Olympic style weightlifting training for the kids, which I think is wow. like such a cool track to like bring kids into. Kids go to Junior Olympics from it. Some yeah. people go beyond it's actually Junior Olympics. Really, wow. really quite impressive. And these initiatives mean a lot to these kids. Tell me more about that. What, the, what this initiative means to these kids particularly. <clears throat> I remember hearing about kids doing boxing, like, oh, boxing programs for underserved youth. And I, I never understood why you would want kids to hit each other or weightlifting or like that seems so weird for a kid yeah. until I started working with kids who had physical desires inside their bodies that were coming out in ways that weren't as beneficial mm -hmm. and so mm -hmm. then you get them tied into something where they can use that physical prowess but actually becomes a life changer. Yeah. Like a big life changer. Yeah, wonderful. Amazing. Wonderful. So it's a, an amazing effort that you guys are supporting and the community can get involved by either buying tickets Make or a just making a donation, and we'll have all of this information on our website. But we definitely uh, are looking forward to it. I can't wait to hear some of the jokes. Are you guys writing the jokes yourselves? Writing is a strong word. <laughs> I, I'm writing my You're writing jokes. some yeah, jokes? I just okay. do the main topics, race and religion. Okay. So I've got those together. <laughs> I figure it should be pretty Perfect. good. That's going to be great. Yeah, it's going to be, be a great time. We can't. We can always use a laugh, can't we? Always. Laughter is the best medicine, after all. All right. Well, coming up after the break, we sit down with the Beaufort County School District to learn more.